Hey guys, Jamin here with PC Monkey. I'm bringing you another do-it-yourself computer video. I have an ASUS laptop here, and the problem I'm gonna show you how to fix in this video is if your battery's not charging. You could be getting a battery not installed, error, battery not detected, 0% uh, available, plugged in, not charging is a common error. So any error like that where your battery is just not charging, I'll show you how to fix in this video. As a side note, keep in mind if you have any questions through this, if you see anything that I don't cover, check out the frequently asked questions below in the description. They could save you some time on getting an answer. If you don't see your question there, leave me a comment. I do try to get back to you guys a few times a day at least. So the first thing we're going to try to fix this is what's known as a static discharge. Uh, many of you, if you've called into warranty repair lines in the past, this is the first thing they'll have you do to self-diagnose what's happening with your computer. Uh, so power down your computer and I'll show you how to do that. So the first thing you're going to want to do is unplug your charger and then remove your battery. If you can't just easily slide your battery out to get it out, most likely you have an internal laptop battery. Uh, check out the video link below it in the description for an example on how to access an internal battery. If you're uncomfortable opening your computer up, the best thing you can do is look for a teardown or disassembly video on your exact model computer. That'll tell you step by step how to open it up and get into it. It'll limit your chances of damaging anything when you go in. If for some reason you cannot find a teardown video on your exact model, uh, leave me a message. I may be able to find one for you or I may be able to walk you through how to get into your computer. After your computer's powered down and it's lost the charger and the battery, we're going to hold down your power button for one minute. After holding down your power button for a minute, you can put your battery back in and your charger back in. After doing that to your computer, try turning it back on, see if those errors are still there, see if your battery is still not charging. If it's still not charging, we're going to double check your charger at this point. Your charger, if you flip it over, will have a bunch of statistics and labels on it. It'll have a volt rating and an amp rating. Underneath your computer, there will also be a volt rating and an amp rating. Sometimes it's under your battery if you have a slide out one like I did. Make sure the volt rating and amp rating of your charger matches the volt and amp rating of your laptop. If the volts and amps do not match what your laptop needs, this could be your issue. If it's too low, you could be underperforming your computer, and if it's too high, you could be damaging your computer. So either way, that could be giving you your warning that could be why your battery is not charging. If you find your charger is rated correctly and you want to make doubly sure that even though it says it's rated correctly, it's acting healthy, there will be a video link below in the description on how to test your charger to make sure that what it's putting out is what it says it should be putting out. So after we've tried a static discharge and after we've made sure the charger is both rated correctly and healthy, now I'm going to try to update all your drivers, make sure all your updates are processed, that could be an issue. Uh, at this point, step number three, there'll be a video link below in the description on how to update a Windows 10 ASUS laptop. Check that out for running all your updates and getting all those processed. So after running your updates, if you're still getting these errors and if your laptop battery is still not charging, we're going to try one more thing before we write it off as your battery's bad and you need to buy a new one. We're going to try to go after the driver for specifically that function. What you're going to do now is go down to the bottom left of your screen into your search bar and type in device manager. There it is, device manager under control panel. That's what we want. Hit enter. On the left here, we're going to expand batteries. And then this top one, Microsoft AC adapter, going to right click on that and hit uninstall device. After you've uninstalled that driver, restart your computer and then go back into the updates and make sure your updates are processed. That's kind of resetting the driver, uninstalling it and then reinstalling it. So that's kind of your last step here. If none of these steps have worked and your battery's still not charging or you're still getting the error, at this point it's safe to say your battery's dead and, and you need a new one. Uh, so if you need any help finding a new one, let me know. Uh, I can help you find one. Uh, any questions on anything else, check out the FAQs below. You may save some time getting an answer. Uh, if you don't see your answer, definitely leave it for me. I get back to you guys a few times a day at least. Uh, like and share if this is helpful. And subscribe if you enjoy do-it-yourself computer repair. Thanks for watching, guys.